Welcome to 6,100 feet of elevation, round five of the 2009 Lucas Oil AMA Pro Motocross Championship hosted at Thunder Valley Raceway in Lakewood, Colorado, just outside the Mile High City of Denver. Let's go racing in the 250 class. Moto number one, Monster Energy Pro Circuit Kawasaki Horsepower on display in the elevation. At 377 of Christoph Porcel, the whole shot. The 19 of Jake Weimer's teammate right behind him. And you had Brock Tickle in the Star Racing Yamaha and the Geico Power Sports Honda of Blake Wharton in fourth. Those four stayed close and edged themselves away from the rest of the field. Later in the race, Porcel would pull a little bit of a gap on his teammate Weimer, who admitted he tightened up. Weimer's been struggling a bit this year. He was happy to just take second with Tickle and Wharton right behind them, third and fourth. Meanwhile, championship rival to Porcel, Ryan Dungey, tangled with a few riders in turn one. He was way back. He had to fight his way from outside the top 20 for a hard-earned sixth place. Tommy Searle on the factory muscle mill KTM just able to hold him off for fifth. Motor number two, Weimer, another great start. He's out front early. As for Porcel, the Frenchman got stuck in the gate, bounced around as he hit that thing early in Moto2. Porcel was dead last. He passed 23 riders on lap one, got himself into 17th, fought his way through traffic. Weimer challenged by the 151 of Justin Barsha. Weimer crashes. Barsha takes the lead. Weimer gets back up, moves from third to second, then challenges Barsha and takes over the lead. Jake Weimer would take a 2-1 score to his first ever AMA Pro Motocross victory. Congrats to the man out of Idaho. Meanwhile, the championship contenders, Porcel and Dungey, they would be involved in a tremendous six-rider fight. Eventually, Dungey would emerge with a fourth as Searle held him off again. Second goes to Barsha. Brett Metcalf executes a last lap pass on Porcel to cost the series leader a few points, but either way, with a second place finish, Porcel extends his points lead over Dungey. Congratulations also on the podium, Tommy Searle. Let's go to the 450 class. Mike Alessi looking to put in a hero effort and score some points with a broken kneecap. A good start behind the Hondas of Ivan Tedesco and Chris Blows early. Alessi a little off the pace with the injury. We get passed by his teammate Chad Reed and a few other riders, but then bumped into by Josh Grant in a racing incident on the, la on the first lap. Alessi lands right on the knee. That would end him for the day and maybe even for the season. A heartbreaker for the number 800. Meanwhile, Ivan Tedesco out front and flying. The strongest performance we've seen out of Ivan Tedesco in years. No challengers in this moto. Tedesco rolls to the first moto victory. His teammate Andrew Short coming through the pack. Fights his way into the number two spot. Chad Reed is not the same rider that he was two weeks ago at our last race at High Point in Pennsylvania. He finishes third, but he was not happy with that performance, giving up points to the two Honda riders up front. Under the lights for Moto2, could Tedesco put the finishing touches on his first victory in five years? Well, he was ready, and he got the whole shot in Moto2, but this time Short was right there behind him, and they went at it in the early lap. Short challenging his teammate at every turn. Finally, Tedesco begins to put a burst of speed together, pulls away from Short, and then Short would be challenged by the 48 of Tommy Hahn. Hahn passes Short for second, then goes off the track. Short gets him back. That makes Andrew Short 2-2 on the day for second overall. Hahn on the podium in third, but Ivan Tedesco rolling a 1-1 score. He takes his first ever win in the Premier 450 division and begins to creep into the points race because Chad Reed struggled big time in that one, following up his third in Moto 1 with the seventh in Moto 2. The Honda boys are closing the gap. That's the racing from the Mile High City. That's round five of the Lucas Oil AMA Pro Motocross Championship. I'm Jason Wygant. We'll catch everyone next week for a July 4th special at Redbud in Buchanan, Michigan, just outside of South Bend, Indiana. See you there.